Uh, all right. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Tonight, we're gonna, I'm going to share God's Word. And the topic of my message is salt and light. Mm. Right? And the scripture reading is from Matthew chapter, uh, chapter 5, verses 13 to 16. But I'm going to emphasize just on light, not on salt. There's light and salt in those verses mentioned. But tonight, Aj, I will Kali share karenge Jyoti Kivishi. Light. तुम पृथ्वी के नमक हो परंतु यदि नमक का स्वाद बिगड़ जाए तो वह फिर किस वस्तु में नमकीन किया जाएगा फिर वह किसी काम का नहीं केवल इसके कि बाहर फेंका जाए और मनुष्यों के पैरों तले रौंदा जाए तुम जगत की ज्योति हो जो नगर पहाड़ पर बसा हुआ है वह छिप नहीं सकता और लोग दिया जलाकर पैमाने के नीचे नहीं परंतु दीवट पर रखते हैं तब उससे घर के सब लोगों को प्रकाश पहुंचता है उसी प्रकार तुम्हारा उजियाला मनुष्यों के सामने चमके की वे तुम्हारे भले कामों को देख तुम्हारे पिता की जो स्वर्ग में है बड़ाई करें आमीन तो हम देखते हैं दो भाग हैं दो चीज जो वचन के अनुसार है ज्योति है और नमक ठीक है लाइट सोल्ड एंड लाइट बट आज के रात आई विल बी फोकसिंग ऑन लाइट ज्योति पे ठीक है सोल्ड पे नहीं ओ मे बी नेक्स्ट टाइम बट आज टुनाइट आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट लाइट सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द होली स्क्रिप्चर्स हु आर वी according to the according to the light light in these vases yeah. right light and salt right mm -hmm. light and salt so i'm talking about light mm -hmm. uh, so we are the salt and the light on the earth mm -hmm. so tonight we will examine the purpose of the light kali jyoti ke vishay mein so what is the spiritual meaning of the light so so i've got the uh, question but i'm going to give you answers as well but i like you to interact i like you to participate so anyone can say anything you, no one is right and wrong scripture is right i'm going to share from the scripture but what do you guys think what is the spiritual meaning of the light so you can give your opinion or view or your knowledge about it you can share so anyone if you say i mean if you want to say something you can because jesus is the light of the world and because we are his children yes so we represent him so we are the light, light of the world amen anyone else same you guys agree with the Shelly? Yes. Yeah. Hmm? Or someone else, other, something else? No? Yeah, the light is like we, it, when we take the same vessel, yes. we become alive once we come to know Jesus and his teachings and his righteousness once we know it. That is what we become and that's how we are and that's how we represent God. Yeah. What mm -hmm. God is within us. Mm -hmm. In the ways of God, Yeah. Uh, if we follow that, then when others look at us, they see that different. And they are sometimes mm. they think, how oh, he is, why am I not like that? Oh, I want to be like that. Mm. Something like that. Yes. That is how we become the light. Yes. And we can only become the light through the Holy Spirit oh, yes. and the righteousness of God. We can't become the light with our own strength. Yes, true. Mm -hmm. Very true. Amen. So Jesus said, He is the light, light of the world. In John 8, 12, he said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will have the light of life in them. Yeah. Therefore, they will not um, follow the darkness. You know? They will have the light of life in them. So, so what is the spiritual meaning of the light? Thank you. Thank you for your input. Uh, in the Bible, light has always been a symbol of holiness, goodness, worldly knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. grace hope and god's revelation Amen. okay so there's a when we um when when i share about light then i look a bit more thoroughly and uh i break it in details so yes generally speaking we are the light on this earth christ is the light who is in us but the, let's see in detail a little bit more thoroughly um and understand what actual light means and what 
it does through us. Amen? And in us as well. So I mentioned a symbol of holiness, goodness, godly knowledge, wisdom, understanding, grace, hope, and God's revelation. By contrast, now if you look at the opposite side of light, darkness has been associated with evil. Mm. Right? Sin, evil, sin, and despair. Despair ke matlab hai, despair means complete feeling of hopelessness. Complete feeling of hopelessness, no hope at all, depression and deeper depression. Mm -hmm. So opposite side of life is sin and yeah. evil, sin and evil mm -hmm. and complete no hope, hopelessness. Mm -hmm. So whereas light means holiness, goodness, yeah, godly knowledge, wisdom and understanding, grace, hope and God's mm -hmm. revelation. And there's more, but I just pick few. So that's what light means. So we will look. So now I'm going to share my notes. We will look at the meaning of eight qualities of the light, which should radiate through our life, Christians' life, on this. Earth. So I'm going to share eight qualities or character characteristics of light. So I did mention already holiness. So what is holiness? No one is right and wrong. Can give your thoughts. Can give your opinions. And you can say something if you like. What is holiness in your understanding or in your mind, in your opinion? What is holiness? Okay, holiness would be if we think in the ways... How the Bible teaches us the word of God brings holiness in us. Amen. Amen. Outgoing. Thank you, Bayan. The same God is holy. Yes. And because He is holy, there is a perfect example of the holiness. Orku. And then one more. It's the definition free of sins. Yes. Amen. Yes. And living your life according to the word of God. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Because we all are learning. We are learning and growing. There's no such thing as I know, I know everything. There's no such thing. The moment you say that you will fall on your face because of pride will get in. Remember that. So, holiness is simply separation unto God. Okay? Bachan ke nusar ab hum batata aap log ke. Aur to bachan ke jo mutabik se batlata to bachan kya keta hai? Holiness, pavitrata ke vishu mein. Okay? Holiness is simply separation unto God. It involves walking with God and allowing Him total access to all areas of our lives. Pavitrata ke matlab yehi hai ki permission hum log ke concentrate karte hain. Thik hai? Hum hum log ke aside mil jate hain. Apne naam se pukarte hain. Alag karte hain. Chaatte hain. Separate karte hain. Hum log world mein hai but we are not for...